<sighs> for me though, I mean, welcome back to the channel. It's good to be back. Um, I fucking caught COVID. You won't even believe it. Like literally I fucking, for the first time, two years. Literally I've been two years just COVID free. Uh, last week, it was uh, honestly one of the worst weeks of my life. It was garbage. Today, we're reacting to the Paracosm Trials Clockwork. This is a new, uh, I guess, the next part of the series of the first Paracosm Trials video that we watched. Once again, Mr. Paracosm sent it to me. Hey, feel me, bro? We like this. Seriously, I appreciate it. I'm not going to do too much talking. It says that this video is set in three different time periods and... It's a bunch of like jumbled tapes and stuff like that with hidden messages for the viewer to like try to decode. We're gonna see if I decode it or not. I'm not too good at that kind of shit, but we're gonna try our best um, without doing too much talking. Let's watch. Um, legend tells, hold on. Legend tells long ago the Paracosm was believed to be the birthplace of all magic. If you guys wanna read all this, pause the video because guess what? We're moving on. Ugh. <laughs> Okay. What is that? I guess we'll find out. It looks like two people. All right, 1983, two years before. Hold on, before we even like keep on moving on in this shit, I don't want this to be like too long. Um, And by the way, I'm trying to record this video while YouTube is like freaking the fuck out. I guess the website is down, but fix it, fix it YouTube, let's go. Okay. 1983, two years before. I just now realized you guys probably fucking <laughs> could hear my background. I'm sorry if it was echoing. I'm sorry. Um, the following recording, January 13th, 1983, documents the conversation between Jackson County police responder Vince Tanner and farmer Jeff Mares, deceased. Okay, Jeff Mares, deceased. The call details Jeff's final moments before the connection was abruptly severed. Police arrived at his home shortly after. Discovered Jeff's headless corpse hanging upside down from the rafters of his barn. Of his barn. Along with 14 headless chickens surrounding him in a circle, the barn was set ablaze prior to arrival but was able to be subdued. So they think it's the work of a demonic cult. What the fuck? November 10th, 1983. Okay. What am I supposed to make of that? 911, what's your emergency? Yes, hello. My name is Jeff Mayers. Um, I'm located off the ranch off Turney Street. I'm calling today because I woke up to feed my chickens as usual. Well, all their heads are missing. They are man he's not and he sounds like a uh you know a black guy like he sounds black dude he's he doesn't have enough like he don't he sound like he don't care you know what i'm saying he sound like he's not in fight or flight mode if that makes sense and i feel like if any one of people like me we're in fight and flight mode if we walk into some shit like that that ass it's, it's ridiculous they are missing i'm not following sir yes sir Somebody came in the night, and cut the heads off on my hand, and stole their eggs too. Stole their I'm eggs. Sure it wasn't another animal, a wolf or a dog, maybe. Mm, no, sir. This wasn't no wolf. I mean, these cuts are clean. Somebody took a machete to him. Uh, I bet you was a damn Jackson boy. Always meddling around my barn. I mean, oh shit! To test me all right, but I take that too damn far. <laughs> You guys see that? It's called, I just fucking lost my shit. What are we talking about right now? Hold on, let me, let me go back, cause. I'm taking it too damn far. Oh, I couldn't pause it. 
That shit scared the fuck out of me. I can't even lie. What are we looking at? Oh! Oh! I don't know if I should... I mean, you can't really see it, but I know exactly what that is. This is Jeff's body hanging upside down. This is where his head is supposed to be. Yikes. Missing Naomi Stanton. 1987, two years after. Ever since that day, most major networks stopped broadcasting their programs on TV, all except for one. It mostly plays reruns of old shows and movies and Honestly, nowadays I spend most of my time in front of it because I have nobody else to keep me company. For the past couple nights, uh, around 5.30 I hope y'all got your headphones turned up. Um, I don't play that shit. Hold on. No, sir. No, sir. We do not play that. We do not play that. Ugh. Fool me though, I mean, fool me. Let's continue. I don't know what the hell they are, but I want to document them because, I don't know, something's telling me that there may be something deeper here. Uh, night of the first day, 5.30 a.m. That almost scared me. Didn't get me though. Not this time. Hold on. Can't skip past that. Somebody's watching like on this TV. Bro's not even flinching. Whoever's watching. Night of the second day. I can't. Oh, it's a chicken head. It's a fucking chicken head. Like the chickens who ended up headless at the beginning. Who's watching with us? Bro, I'm like confused. I don't get like what are, what are we talking about the nights? What are we spending the night for? What are we watching while we're spending the night? Um maybe maybe it'll make more sense as the shit goes on. I'm not looking into nothing. The real world is your enemy. Join the paracosm. Oh, that's fire. Is this some sort of like recruitment type of type of video that this guy is watching? That's what it seems like. Mmm.
What is that? That's fucking crazy. I don't want to see that. Oh my god. That's disgusting. I'm going to lose my shit. Seriously. I can't read that, whatever that was. Escape this torment. This is obviously some sort of recruitment video, I feel like. And whoever's watching it is trying to get recruited. Uh to a cult maybe. 1985, I arrived. 23 years, man. I'm grateful. I survived. We were supposed to get past 25. Jokes on you, motherfucker. We alive. All these niggas popping now is young. Every Got a face. It's the end of the world. I'm glad I turned on uh, cap closed captions. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Cause you're not about to do that to me. Colossal statue, global mystery, 1985 statues unearth. A global mystery, following story. I, I couldn't pause the video. I was about to get nervous for a second. Did y'all see that? Let's hurry up and get through this video. The monster lurking below. I feel like I really want to read this though, low key. US government officials. Most victims of these demons were completely mutilated. And a large percentage of these individuals were missing their heads. Oh my God. What? It's like. Five colossal statues. Okay. I want to say I know what's going on, but I really don't. I feel like, you know what I mean? It got to be some cult is worshiping these statues. And that's what's causing like, or the cult. I feel like the cult is worshiping the statues or something, bro. The Paracosm Trials Clockwork. Oh yeah, that's fire. Pop it up. Oh my god, I wish I understood though. I feel like I feel like I just watched that whole thing. Alright, um, like I said guys, what I'm getting from it is 
a cult is worshiping these statues and that's why like the world is about to fucking end or some shit like that um if you guys enjoyed the video make sure you like comment subscribe turn the post notifications i'll catch you guys in the next video peace